Now here's how you can make your Apple Watch distraction free. So before we get started, make sure you are subscribed to this channel so you never miss videos like these. Let's get into it. So the first thing is the Apple Watch face. So you can see we've got something like this going on where I have like the activity, the time, a oh, couple of widgets, you know, calendar widgets at the bottom. This might be distracting. So the first step would be to change the watch face. So you can just swipe I mean, hold down on it, then swipe right here and start or create a new one and find something which is much less distracting, right? So for example, this one is quite literally just the time hand. So I can add it like this, you know, we can add some complications, which I'm not going to do. And now I have this like very simple watch face, which only shows me the time and nothing else, right? So that's pretty useful. Another thing would be in order to like keep you at focus or whatever you want to do, keep it a distraction free is to set up or disable notifications for your Apple Watch. Constant beeping on your wrist is probably not good. So you can open up the watch application on the iPhone, which is paired to that Apple Watch and in here find notifications. So it is quite literally the first thing right here. So you, for example, have the notification indicator, which is like this uh, red dot, which appears on the top of the screen to indicate for notification. So I guess you can turn it off as well. And also at the bottom, you have all of the notifications for specific apps, right? So if you want to keep your Apple Watch clean of any of these notifications like Gmail and stuff like this, you can turn it off and just keep it that way. And obviously all of the other apps right here it's also possible to just turn it off entirely in terms of notifications. So that's a good way to keep the Apple Watch distraction free. Also for like a general approach on the watch, what you can do is to click the side button like this. And obviously you can enable the uh, this like do not disturb mode, right? So you can set it up. Obviously it is linked with your iPhone so you can change the settings of your focus modes like, like here. So you can turn on the do not disturb mode or uh, some specific personal or other modes which can be set up uh, in a very specific way on your device to choose people which can or cannot contact you. Same with, uh, with apps and stuff. So make sure to do that. And you can also just enable it on your wrist like this, right? So you can just turn it on and you have this also turn on on your iPhone. Another interesting thing is the theater mode. So essentially this is turn is going to turn on the silent mode and will also keep the screen dark as it says right here until you tap the screen. So essentially it's not going to light up every time you flick your wrist. So it can also uh, prevent some distractions during your work. So these are my tips on things you can do in order to keep your Apple Watch distraction free. Let me know down below in the comments if there's anything else specifically that you use. I'm quite curious to hear about that. If you like the video, make sure to hit the thumbs up and subscribe so you never miss videos like these. I'll see you in the next one.